the fuck going on with y'all man welcome back to another episode of one piece all right so last episode we finally saw the backstory of nami nojiko and bel san all right and of course it was a good one it was a sad one it had me all aboard on the field train all that type of shit you know bell mary was a former marine female warrior she just you know she was on the battlefield literally about to die she checked out mentally she was ready to go you know say what's up to god and whatever um and then she heard the baby crying of nami with nojiko's fucking two-year-old holding nami in her arms instantly became their mother you know you know brought them went through the seven seas to come back home you know, and then uh, raise them, raise them as, uh, raise them as babies to where they are now, you know? Um, and it's sad because not only seeing her check out mentally, and then, you know, they basically, those babies, Nami and Nojiko, gave her a second life, you know? Um, and of course she saved them, so it's like they saved each other. So not only is it sad and feels because of that, but bell mary doesn't exist in the current eight years later so she dies somehow and i feel like as arlong has entered the battlefield we're about to see that now and um i mean shit it's kind of already hurting talking about it i'm not gonna lie to you all the backstories that we've seen so far i've only taken one episode this one they're taking a couple maybe even three so they definitely saved the last the 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 best most sad backstory for last i feel like you know because again in the intro there's luffy there's zoro there's usopp there's sanji and there's nami we've seen four of them we've seen all their other backstories flashbacks and all that but we haven't seen nami's until now and it looks like they're taking more than one episode to do it so again this is probably the best one um and i can already feel it you know that first one was crazy we saw the origin and now i'm about to see how everything basically how everything hit the fan arlong is charging millions to just live here fucking tyrant dude um and just knowing bell mary off of one episode i already know how she's gonna fucking react to a bully coming up to her she's not gonna fly with that shit and of course arlong is not gonna fly with that shit two alphas is normally a bad clash um so i think that's where we're about to find out how she dies so anyway that's where we are in the story so without further ado let's go and get into it this is one piece i think we're on episode 36 you know what i'm saying 36 already i feel like i'm flying past these episodes baby um anyway if you guys are not a member members get access to all their early reactions i'm like 20 30 episodes ahead right now of one piece so if you want to catch those early episodes click that join button down below to become a member of the channel okay and of course if you want the full versions of those reactions to go along with those episodes of one piece hit up my patreon which is linked down below in the description all right along with my discord server down there as well you know you want to talk about some one piece join there and come talk about it with me you know what i'm saying and everyone else uh, and of course, last but not least, if you guys haven't already, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell for notifications, and share the video if you can, because that all helps towards the algorithm and helps support the channel, you know what I'm saying? Other than that, OP36, let's get it. Okay, tangerine duck, rice omelets. Sounds like a good ass meal. I mean, that's pretty much orange chicken and rice, fried rice, right? <laughs> that's pretty much what she said. Should I eat that? There we go. The finale of the backstory, I feel like. Best of luck. I don't know what the fuck happens. But uh, I mean, I got a bad feeling. Oh! Holy. I was not expecting her to greet him with that. Damn, she actually, she's actually strong as hell. Like that, that's a, they're, they're making these fishmen like they're made of steel and she was able to kick him down like that. 
く聞くんだ二人ともこんな時にいやこんな時だからこそお前たちに少々残酷な話をせねばならんドクターああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああ Oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god. Let's, like, her arm is crushed. Damn. He's trying. He's looking out for her. He's trying. Okay. I mean, that's a little. That, that must hurt a little bit, but I mean, that, that, if that's going to save her life, then we got to go. And last episode, she was complaining how they're so poor. Where now it's literally a matter of life and death with having money. I hate that, man. Because that'd be low key true. If you ain't got money, you really can't live. Shit. Oh no. Fuck. Alright, well, that's how she dies. Damn. That's how she dies. Sticking up for her kids. Fuck. I'm sad. Anyone else sad? Can I have some ice cream? <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> like, even her struggling with her crushed arm trying to give her a hug? <laughs> They're paying attention to, to the details here. Whoa! Damn, shout out to Gen, bro. With his weird little thing in his head. Oh, the villagers are trying to help too? Damn. Oh, final words. Oh, no! I ain't finna cry, hell no. No! Are you kidding me? I'm kinda mad. Ooh. <laughs> Fuck, bro. Nah. We gotta get this dude. I don't give a fuck if we ain't strong enough. We gotta get this dude. Nah, bro. Come on, dude. Luffy, please. If you ain't strong enough, you gotta muster up some strength. Use everything. Friends and family, jutsu. You know, talk no jutsu, Luffy, I don't care. You gotta, you gotta get this man. <laughs> fuck. Oh. Oh, fuck. This is like terror, dude. Straight up terror. Oh my god. Like, they made Arlong's group look like straight-up terrorists right now. Like, I'm feeling it. You know what I'm saying? Damn. I'm pissed, yo. I'm trying to square up with Arlong. <laughs> oh, fuck. See, like, the way that sounds, it's like she's betraying them, but we know her uh, real endgame goal. You know what I mean? Damn. There it is. Tattoo? Like that? Ooh. It's looking like she swore her allegiance to Arlong. But then again, we know what it is. Oh shit. Oh shit. I mean, she's saying it out loud. Damn. 
Damn. This is drama, yo. Like, this is some soap opera drama shit. What the fuck? Hmm. And that made the villagers not want to fight. And them fighting would have led them to their death. So Nami, again, she kind of saved them. She's being the bad guy. Then to do that at such a young age, that is way too mature. I'm sorry. That's like not realistic, but hey, some kids are built like that, I guess. That makes sense. That makes sense. She made a deal. I'll work with them. I'll give him the money so he can fuck off. <laughs> That's what it is. Damn. Well, Bear Mary did what she wanted to do, right? She said she wanted to raise these two young girls to become strong as hell. And as far as I'm concerned, Nami is the strongest. Are you serious? To be able to put that burden on yourself as like a 10 year old? That's different, dude. Damn, I didn't even realize that. Every time she went out, she was risking her life to get that money, stealing from pirates or whatever. Like, literally risking her life every single time for the people in the village. Holy fuck, bro. It just goes deeper. <laughs> it's crazy. This shit good. No, I'm liking this. This shit good. The thing is, though, is it really going to be over? You think Arlong is really going to be like, all right, bye. Thanks for the hundred million. You think he's really just going to leave? I don't think so, man. We we just we just saw how much of a shit bag he is. You know what I'm saying? So. <sighs> No. 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 And you know what's crazy? What do we see when we first met Arlong? We saw him giving some money to that exact Marine. So I think we're supposed to think that Arlong paid him off to come to Nami. Just so it's not on Arlong's, you know, ledger. And just be like, hey, she's getting close to paying me off. I need y'all to take all of her shit. So she needs to start over. <gasps> Is that what's happening? Oh, fuck. No. No. Bro. Eight years is a long ass time. That's eight years, dude. Eight years ago, I was motherfucking... I was in school. <laughs> was I? I think so. Um, damn. No. No. Wait. That's like crushing. Especially after seeing the backstory. Imagine being in Nami's shoes. Eight years. Stealing from pirates. Risking her life on a daily basis. Staring in the face of a man that murdered her mom. And threatening the people that she loves on a daily basis. And now... All that work is about to be taken from her. <gasps> oh, fuck. That's good. It's obviously not good, but you know what I'm trying to say. It's good for like story, like drama. I feel that. Damn. Wow. Yeah, I mean, I was just saying, a dude like Arlong, is he really gonna leave after you give him the money? Of course he's not. He honestly, it's been eight years is a long ass time. Honestly, he probably feels like it's his home. So why would he leave? That's what I'm thinking. He's not just gonna leave because of eight hundred million. 
and this is how he does it. This is how he this is how he stays. He goes behind her back on some navy marine shit. And some rat. Damn. I would be fucking pissed. I'd be livid if I was Nami. So what now? She gotta give the money. And if she doesn't, guess what? She's on the Marines radar. Even more. You know? And she's already under she's probably infamous for pirates too you know she's probably known as the pirate stealer so she she won't be good with pirates she won't be she won't she won't be good with marines and she's not good with the she, she's not good with the town because everyone thinks she betrayed them damn she really took the bad guy role to try to save everyone's life nah i definitely underestimated and mistook nami for something else you know she's clearly a great person and you know what luffy zoro usopp sanji i don't even care if they're strong enough we need to go knock on arlong's fucking door and punch him in the face that's what needs to happen and i hope we win i think the odds are stacked against us we have seen how strong these fishmen are but we haven't really seen just how strong we are, especially Luffy. I don't even think Luffy went all out against Don Krieg. I think he still has some, some juice left, you know? So, yeah, I'm thinking it's up now. It's th There's no choice here. We have to fight. Fuck these guys. Literal terrorists, bro. Anyway, two episode backstory, you know. And here's the thing about backstories. Sometimes animes, they take way too long on it. Sometimes animes take like five, 10 episodes on backstories, you know, when it could just be condensed into one Naruto. Uh, <laughs> but um, no, nah, I feel like two episodes was perfect for the amount of shit that happened in Nami's backstory. And I mean, y'all saw the reaction. I was feeling every single part of it. My heart was broken. When they killed Ben Mary, y'all saw- I got teary-eyed low-key, bro. Like, nah, that's just wild. Um, but yes, I was- I feel like I was right in the fact that they were saving the best backstory for last. Because that is some sad shit. Like, heart-wrenching shit, man. You know? And of course, uh, the- the background music, the stills, and the facial expressions that they were showing, well done as well. I can't, I, I don't wanna, you know, overlook that. That shit was well done. Again, the people that are doing this show, um, I think their strongest, so far what I'm noticing, the strongest um, parts for me is the fighting and the feels moments. I feel like they're doing those two things pretty well so far and I mean, that's just the top two shit in anime you're supposed to do anyway, along with the story shit. So, um, yeah, they're doing that really, really well. And again, I felt, I felt it. I was all, I was on board the fuel train and I'm still on that bitch waiting to get my stop. <laughs> okay. Um, nah, good shit, dude. All right. Well, nah, Arlong needs to, we need, we, we need to get him. We need to put him behind bars, kill him, whatever, whatever it takes. You know, we got to save Nami. Fuck that. No, I want to, I want to fight. Okay. I'm pissed <laughs> anyway. Hey man, good ass episode, good ass backstory. And Hey, if you guys thought that was a good ass reaction, y'all know what to do, man. Like comment, subscribe, hit that bell for notifications and share the video. If you can, obviously, you know what I'm saying? And of course, uh, if you're not a member of the channel, members get access to all the early reactions. I'm like 20 30 episodes ahead of one piece right now so if you want to catch those early episodes of one piece click that join button down below to become a member of the channel okay and of course uh, if you want the full versions of these reactions to go along with those episodes of one piece hit up the patreon which is linked down below in the description along with my discord server so if you want to talk about some one piece hit me up in there or the rest of us you know we've got a nice little community going on right uh and last but not least of course um Y'all have a good one. All right. Thank you for watching. I truly appreciate it. And I'll see y'all on the next episode of One Piece. Bye.